with Tony and Elliot away for the weekend. On Saturday, Mum and I visited Gates Nurseries for afternoon tea. We often visit Gates as it's just 10 minutes from us on the Leicestershire and Rutland border. There are two places to eat, the original and smaller courtyard coffee shop for drinks, cakes and light meals, and the much larger garden restaurant offering breakfasts, hot and cold lunches and afternoon tea. Afternoon tea is £17.50 for one, or £34.99 for two, and it's served every day from 2pm till 4pm. Booking is not required, though we would recommend it if you plan to visit at a busy time such as Christmas, or if it's for a special occasion. Vegan, vegetarian, gluten-free and children's options are also available. We hadn't booked and we arrived just after three o'clock. It was quite quiet by then and we chose a table by the window, which overlooks the terrace and the fields beyond. We were sat at table 48, but the sun started to stream through and blinded mum a bit, so we moved along to the next table. We ordered via the website on my phone at the table. It's very easy to use, but you can also go up to the counter to order if you prefer. You can add any dietary requirements to the notes section when ordering, so we requested no mustard as mum doesn't like it. Our drinks arrived quickly. We had a large pot of tea for two, which is refilled free of charge, though we didn't need a refill, probably because I cheekily added a small bottle of Prosecco to the order for me. Our food came shortly after and our waitress double checked our dietary requirements and ensured we knew about the tea refills and that we could have a box to take items home if we needed to. The sandwiches were great, super fresh and soft bread with tasty fillings. We had ham, which usually is made with mustard, uh, cheese and pickle, egg mayonnaise and tuna mayonnaise. There were two scones each, fruit ones and plain ones, served with Rodder's clotted cream and tip tree strawberry jam. They were small scones, but actually they were the perfect size given the number of sweet treats on the top tier. The sweets were delicious and generous in size. We each had a mini Victoria sponge, a lovely piped meringue and two tarts. One was a gorgeous lemon tart and the other a rich chocolate one. We couldn't fault this afternoon tea at all. Everything was freshly made and tasty, the tea was great and everyone who served us was so friendly and helpful. We took a couple of items home to eat later but we think this afternoon tea is an excellent size portion wise and it's definitely one we'd return for.